Welcome to the next part of this exercise. So one of the most frequently asked questions in the support center, is the steps involving the analysis of a model under a different design code. And if the corresponding workflow is any different, from that we have seen while using the ACI code. Well in actuality, the particular design code we choose to use, doesn't really affect the tools, nor to workflow utilized for designing and analyzing a given structural model. But it does however change somehow the criteria which should be followed by the structural engineer. Namely, and for avoiding errors during the development of the model, that the structural engineer should already be familiar with the requirements given by a particular design code. In other words, you shouldn't blindly trust that the program will perform 100% of the needed modifications throughout the model, with just changing to a different design code. Of course that's not to say that robot structural, want give us all the flexibility for performing said modifications. But that you should be aware of the main differences between codes, design requirements according to a particular region, and so on. So as an example of this, let's go ahead, and attempt to analyze this model under the Eurocode. Well this time everything seems to be correct. As we haven't obtained any remarks whatsoever. So and in this fashion, you can begin analyzing your structural model under any given design code.